can't deny it, you know? <laughs> Just to get the eagle on there took me like four hours. I love the back, how it kind of comes together. I'm sure that people have done art shows with helmets, but I've never been to one. Or heard of one, I guess. Probably the first time in Portland that it's been done, or at least in my lifetime. I like to just put on events every two months or just something to like get people together. And in the wintertime, there's not a lot of stuff going on around motorcycling and you can't really ride, so you never really see people. I think like I just wanted it to be a weird people, like just a spectrum of people, you know? Like not necessarily motorcycle dudes. My wife and I got drunk and we were laughing about how funny my stupid tattoo on my back was that I got out of a bread truck at a biker rally when I was 22 years old, drinking rum with a German Shepherd licking me that I never show anyone, so very personal and put it on my helmet. That's the story. I don't really know. I think I'm going for the really dirty look. I tattooed it. I started tattooing a line drawing on here. It's very foolish. I made a tattoo needle out of a coat hanger, <laughs> blew the capacitor on the thing, and then uh, and then I inked it in with some etching ink. It's pretty ugly. Just, I want to give it the broken in feel. Uh, we gold leafed it. Seymour Pins drived it, and uh, I'm not here for a long time, I'm here for a good time. So we uh, sort of split that up, did half the put on one side and half on the other. It's round, <laughs> so uh, keeping line weight uh, consistent and uh, smooth and straight, it's tough, always tough. <laughs> paint the outside and then the inside is embroidery, stitching, and that's the, where the real artwork comes in. It's a whale tail print and it's also a mustache print, so it kind of intertwines with the inside of the helmet. That's kind of the inspiration there. I think just having that background um, as my mom being Native American, it just inspired me just to create a headdress for someone to ride around on and it's kind of headdress slash football helmet, something you could go to battle with, you know, it's got an arrow on there, it's got some feathers, it's got some nice medallions on the side.